non-profit company. Um, the organization was formed uh, through private sector um, <clears throat> based on the new PE code, where um, um, the new PE code was pushing private sector to say they need to do more work on enterprise and supply development. So Summit was then formed from that platform. So we then have to put together programs that uh, are on enterprise, the other ones on supplier. Um, so we start working with informal traders. Informal traders, they contribute, they contribute more than the automotive sector to the GDP, contributes about 11%. Uh, percent, uh, that's almost 580 billion. Um, and we then um, also work with cooperatives. Uh, we work with uh, SMMEs. So the biggest challenge, especially um, in the business of South Africa, is how the informal sector is always um, neglect, get neglected. Um, uh, they always feel that uh, they are not prioritized. There's no one who's coming with solutions. There's no one who's doing what. So when the, the project of the, of the solar turtle was presented to us as summit, um, we just saw energy going to our communities and wherever they are. And then when we then investigated further, was to then say, if you look at types of informal traders, especially, is you've got informal traders that are street vendors, you've got um, tap shops, you've got um, people who are like your pen and bitters in township, or people doing different type of uh, informal trading in the townships. So we then, um, then started looking at saying how the, the informal traders, especially in the retail sector, um, and most black people are in the informal sector. So we then looked at saying, how can we then um, get um, our people to be, um, to be recognized and be supported by different sectors of, um, of, 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 of government, of business, of anything uh, in that line. So um, we, you're talking about um, payment system, for example, on informal traders. Um, informal traders, they travel sometimes um, from Pumalanga to go buy things in Marabastad, uh, from Maravastad, they go to Newcastle, Newcastle go to Deben. They travel for five days buying different things and different things and coming back and selling in Pumalana or, or Musina, Toyando or something like that. So they get hijacked because they carry cash. Um, so solutions are needed for, people, for our people to be able to say in whatever business that they are in, there must be must always be solutions that are suitable for their environment. T science is study of technology and technology is application of science. And one thing that science needs to do is to be a solution. For it to be a solution, it must also look at Bonga, we have, we're missing you. Please uh, sorry about that. Yeah. I switched off. Okay. Um, it needs a... We lost you again, Bonga. Please try again. Hello? Yes, yeah, we can hear you. How is it now? Hello? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, uh, a proceed now is better. Hello. Yes, Bonga, we can hear you. Proceed.
Bonga? Yes. Uh, how is it yeah. now? Yeah, it's okay. better. Proceed. Yes. So, um, we, our informal traders um, have just simple things that they wish they could be assisted with. So the energy part is the most critical one because wherever they sell, whether it's in a farm, it's in a mine, um, it's a, because when they, when they are trading on the street in, in, in Jupiter Street, it's like they have to charge their phones, even themselves, from the shops behind and pay 10 rand or 15 rand. But if they can charge and still own that to say they can resell that energy, um, for, for, for us, we, we will be so excited. So what happened early this year, uh, February 14, February 18, um, we hosted um, a national conference of informal traders where the department and the solar title um, Lungi attended um, to make presentations on what we want to do. Um, and everybody, every member of the informal trader, uh, because it's all the provinces, um, they were all excited. So if we're looking at that, we, we then... Um, we like to take the engagements forward and make sure that our people can benefit from such a, a wonderful technology. I thank you. The other thing is also we do a number of projects. So our space is your manufacturing. Um, we are in the automotive sector, agri and agro processing. We are also about to launch um, uh, in October, we're launching our first 10 um, farm in a box um, concept, which is, um, which is off the grid. Uh, it's containers uh, with the multi things. So we also presented. So um, there are a number of projects in different sectors, like your clothing and textile, <clears throat> um, where people just need basic electricity. Uh, sorry, energy.